It's not a fair, fair election. We have thugs invading all the places. And we did a complaint. Various several and no response. Police presence, they promise us police, they promise us. I mean they promise us service. No more sin. It's an elect it's not it's not an election in the recent. We reject it in totality. Like I said, this is not a fair and fair election. So why will anybody go ahead to declare it? But they have all the facts. So they should not they should not have gone. This is all about democracy. And I'm sure the woman, if he knows they have work committed, will not have done that one. I'm not aware of the claim. Let me resort anyway. So will you go to court? Possibility. Actually, the election is not credible at all. There is nothing like fair and fair in that election. There is a delay in, in the area of sensitive materials and why the talks are invading uh, different polling units. Again, the custodian of law at the level of Lagos State House of Assembly was the one at the, in Orili Agege moving around with talks to intimidate voters, intimidate party delegates, just to allow the APV, APC to, come on, to commit havoc. I'm using this opportunity to tell the Nigerians and Nigeria entirely that Madam Chairman, the Lysek Chairman, I'm so much disappointed in her. Sincerely, with, with her level of education, she performed very, 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 very poor. And with what is on ground, with what is on in Norile Agege presently, we told them to separate all the ballot paper that were not signed and stamped, and total those ones that are signed and stamped, and we discovered that our court is leading with nothing less than 2,000 ahead of them. And still they refuse to announce the result at Norile Agege. Please help us to tell the power that be in Lagos State and in Nigeria entirely, that people, all the opposition parties, we are ready to collect, to take our mandate back. You see what happened at Odiolowo and Moshi? This is not what we are calling for. The people that call themselves Democrats, they failed to live the, up to that expectation. The Lagos State, the Lagos State Honorables, believe me, they have committed a work that history will never forgive them again. You, you will support going to court? Yes. And you are, you are ready to defend whatever to We are ready to pursue it to any length to collect our collective mandate. As it has been said, it was a total failure. In Munsha Ajino, the thugs and hooligans were invading the polling booths. We have the evidences to show to this that the election was never free and fair in Munsha Ajino. Sir, we, we find out that sometimes most of these thugs you know, claim that they were not given money or settled. Was there anything like you know, settlement to, for some area boys during an election like this? That is for the APC people. In our court, we go to the commissioner of police, go to the area commander. We told them that we are peaceful people in our court, in our court party, and what we demanded from them was free and fair election. You can go to area F, go to area D. We requested for free and fair election, even from Lasse. But what we saw yesterday was a total failure, invasion by thugs, the hooligans that we don't even know in Mushi yet. They imported them from other areas. They were invading our ballot papers. All these things started around 2 o'clock downward. The election that was supposed to have been concluded by 2, 2 o'clock, they started invading our polling centers. And the securities, they, at least they provided 1-1 one -one police in the, in, the, in, the, in the polling booths. But they were not harmed. We will never condone this. This is an incredible election.